Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. All right. Yo, 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 yo. This is Games and Graphics. We are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And today we are going to be installing Pull Your Guns Out. This one, um, actually, you get the chance to see your character pull the gun straight from behind them, all right? Um, there's just one picture right here um, that you can see the character actually reaching for the gun um, that's tucked off behind them, all right? So that's what we're going to be installing today. This one right here is created by uh, Negvis, I believe, in HKH191. Shout out to the creators. When you get down to this link, what you want to do is scroll down and always read the full description before you download any um, script or mod, all right? has a lot of important information in here, including the requirements, okay? So uh, definitely make sure that you check this out. After you're done reading the full description, you want to come over here where it says current. Um, it's going to be 1.0 current and select the green arrow to download, all right? Now let's go back to the description where it said requirements. There is going to be two main requirements that we are going to need. Uh, we will be installing these today. Um, you, uh, you will also need ScriptHookV and ScriptHookV.net. We will not be installing those, but I will have links in the description to videos showing you how to install those if you don't have your ScriptHookV and ScriptHookV.net installed already, okay? And also, you will need Open4, all of the requirements. The links will be down in the description, all right? So let's go ahead and jump into the main requirements we are going to need for this to work. We are, for, we are first going to need pickups, all right? Pickups is going to be this one right here, all right? This one is created by Infamous Saber. Shout out to the creator of this one. When you get down to this link right here, you want to scroll down and of course, read the full description. After you're done reading the description, you want to come over here and download where it says current and select the green arrow to download, all right? Now the next uh, requirement that we are going to need is strap in the back of your pants, all right? This is a pickups sub mod right here. This one is made by the Ganja Farmer. Shout out to the creator. When you get down to this page, you wanna do the same thing, read the full description, come over here where it says current and select the green arrow to download, all right? So the three ones that we need downloaded today that we will be installing is pull your guns out for a strap in the back of your pants, pickups, and strap in the back of your pants. <laughs> all right, so once you have all three of those downloaded and your requirements installed, on my left hand side, I have a folder with just three downloads. Those three downloads is pickups, pull your guns out, and strap in the pants okay so for today we are going to be starting with the first one which is pickups open up the pickups folder inside the pickups folder will be a readme and it will be a oiv file which is a package file okay so from this point what you want to do is have your open for installed already and ready to go and you also want to make sure that you have your edit mode turned on in open for okay once you have that done, you can just go ahead and just double click on this OIV file. And as you can see, a window will open up. It will be a package installer window. All right. This is going to be your package installer window for pickups. You can go ahead. Feel free to read all the information inside right here. If you're done doing that, you can come over here and select the install button. Then you want to select mods folder. Then you want to select install confirm installation. After that has been installed, you will see that uh, over here on my right hand side, I have my Grand Theft Auto 5 directory opened up. It's all ready to go. I have all my requirements installed as well. After installing your pickups OIV package you will look in your Grand Theft Auto 5 directory and find that you have a new folder and it's going to say pickups okay this will automatically be installed after you install the package installer for pickups all right now what we want to do is open up this folder pickups all right and we're going to leave the folder open right here okay 
Now let's go back over to our downloads where we had our pickups OIV file at and just select the arrow button to go back. Now we are back here with the rest of our downloads, okay? So the next one that we wanna install is Strap in the Pants. So let's open up Strap in the Pants folder. Inside that folder is going to be one XML document is going to say slots, okay? So we're going to take this slots right here, drag and drop this over into our pickups folder that was just created. And it's going to ask us, uh, the destination already has a file named that, do we want to replace it? Select yes, replace the file in the destination. All right, once that file has been replaced, we are good to go. Now what we want to do is um, go back to our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. All right, and we want to go to our scripts folder, okay? If you don't have a scripts folder, go ahead and create a new folder and name it scripts, okay? And then once you have that created, go ahead and open up your scripts folder. Now let's go back over to our downloads, select the back arrow button. Now we want to select pull your guns out folder. Okay, so open up your pull your guns out folder. Inside pull your guns out folder, you are going to have two files right here, okay? What we wanna do is grab and highlight these two files right here. And we're gonna drag and drop both files into our scripts folder. I already have them as you can see. All right. Now, once that has been installed, we are all good to go. Let's go ahead and run the game. All right, all right, all right, all right. So once you load into the game, as you can see, um, if you hold your weapon wheel, you're automatically going to have four slots, four weapon slots, okay? Usually, I think uh, we have about eight, but um, once this is installed, you'll, you're automatically going to have four by default. You can go into the file, into the configuration settings, and uh, change how many slots you want. You can have uh, anywhere between four and eight if you want, all right? That's uh, why I encourage everybody to read the description, because all the important information is right there, okay? Now, after you uh, load in the game, what you want to do is just um, get yourself a gun. You can do that either by having a trainer, simple trainer. I'll leave that link in the description. And you could just um, go ahead to weapons and, you know, um, just request a gun right there. And as you can see, he has a gun right there that I just requested and he pulled out. And when you put the gun up, let's see, unarm, then you can see him put it right back in his back. And when we pull out the gun, we got to select it. You see him pull it straight out of his pants from his back. All right, this is a nice little cool one also. Um, let me uh, show you a few other things also. As you can see right here, I have a few weapons that I just dropped out. It was actually a lot of weapons. Now, once you go to um, the weapons that are dropped out on the ground, if you have killed some enemies or something, you're gonna see in the top left side of the screen, it's gonna say press a certain button to swap the current weapon you have in your hand with the new weapon that is on the ground, okay? I'm just showing you, for example, that whatever weapons on the ground, this is where your pickups that we installed comes in at, all right? So what we want to do, or what I'm going to do right now, is um, try to get Frank to run a little bit faster. You know, Frank got all these damn skinny jeans, so he can't run that quick. There we go. <laughs> all right, so what I'm going to do is call a couple of police over. And I'm going to show you them dropping weapons or a matter of fact we can just go to the ballers area yeah let's do that um ballers 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 right up there there we go why not go to the ballers area and cause some uh, disturbance let's everything load in right we can, yeah just put up our gun real quick there we go Okay, so let's get in first person mode. We're gonna cause some disturbances with the ballers real quick. Oh yeah, we gotta show me taking out the gun now. There we go. There we go. So as you can see, when you install it, you get extra damage with the gunfire. <laughs> so, 
my uh my little golden revolver right here is actually giving off more power than usual and as you can see see when they drop stuff you'll see it they'll say the name and you go up to it and you can switch out the current for the one you got now like i said uh read the description on download page they'll let you know how to get more slots and uh, where you can carry more weapons Let's go see if they got anything for us because uh, the police, I know they drop a lot of weapons. They drop like shotguns and stuff like that. Um, these guys don't drop nothing. This guy dropped just a pistol. I'm not giving that one up. There we go. I'm not giving that one up for my uh, golden revolver. Alright. Let's go to uh, the police station. everybody fell through the floor because uh thing that <laughs> to spawn around me. all right here we go uh never wanted to take that off and increase one to level all right let's get some cops out here Damn, man. that gun is dead oh yeah oh there they go where the guns at there we go. Y'all got some pistols. Where the guns at, though, man? Oh, we gotta wait till the army get out here or something. There we go. Oh, boy. So we waiting. Let's get. Let's uh, wait till the SWAT get here. The SWAT gets here, then we'll have bigger guns. Right now, these cops are just dropping uh, nine millimeters, right? Yeah, pistols. Oh, there they go. There they go. There go the SWAT. Okay. Now, as we get closer to the SWAT, we should see the guns that drop. And see, there you go. The carbine rifle. So, we can go in. We already picked that one up. See? Um, for that one, since it was a rifle, that goes in its own slot. Alright? So, now, we can just pull out that rifle and start using that rifle. Now, if I pick up a knife or something like that, that will go in its own slot as well. And all these things could be configured. Um, like I mentioned, if you just read the description. Alright, as you can see, see they're dropping pistols. He got a shotgun over here. Let's see, swap the carbon rifle for the pump shotgun. There we go. So we swapped out the carbine for the uh, shotgun. Alright. Wow, this blew him in half right there. Hey, buddy. Oh, he lost an arm. Oh, buddy. Oh, he lost an arm, too. Oh, he lost a leg. <laughs> I love the shotguns. Alright, so this pickups is pretty cool, though. Um, if you want uh, people to be chopped in half and lose arms and legs, you're going to have to download uh, Dismemberment Mod. I have that link on my channel. Go ahead and fall down, guy. You know you don't have any uh, bottom part. Oh. Whoa, is it two dudes without no bottoms? How are y'all doing that? How are y'all chasing me? Look at that. Look at that. There we go. All right. <laughs> How is that happening? You got any other guns for me? Well, we got a shotgun. Alright. Let's try to get closer up on him. We got a good shot. There we go. That was nice. Hey, buddy. Oh, wow. Alright. Okay, so uh, let me go ahead and pull out the gun from behind. Let me put that back up. There we go. Let's pull that out again. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Well, 
I'm gonna wrap up the video right here. This pretty much is gonna cover up how to uh, install it and also pickups and how to pick up the weapons. If you wanna do some configurations or anything like that, you have to check out the download page in the description, all right? I'm just gonna wrap it up for me. Um, if this helps y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video, go ahead and smash that like button for your boy. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with y'all friends starting in the modding channel. Y'all, this is Games of Graphics. Me and Big Ball and Ass Frank. We're gonna sit here and kill some more coppers. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.